Guys, Lauren Hope here. Have you ever watched someone you love die slowly, slowly? Someone you really care about. I'm watching that at the moment. A young 32 year old friend of mine who has serious BPD is basically dying bit by bit. She has been given loads of medication which she takes every time to take overdoses. Yesterday I had to have her arrested to keep her safe because she was walking in front of cars. I asked the police to take her into custody to protect her. They said they weren't allowed to section her but she gets treated as a criminal. She's harassed by her neighbours. She's scapegoated by everyone. She has been threatened with eviction and prison, but she has got BPD. She gets no therapy at all. Nothing. They've forgotten about her. They've thrown her away. Where are her family? Her family? Her family, they do nothing. She lives in total poverty. She has no food. I buy her food. She has no heating. I bought her a heater. I'm asking you to save her life before it's too late. I love her, she is beautiful. She has the most incredible sense of humor. She could be anything she wants to be, but she needs to be loved back. She needs proper therapy like I got in the therapeutic community. She needs a lot of support. She knows it and she's asking for it. It's getting to the point where she's going to die because she wants to die because they've taken away her respect and her dignity. I have watched this for five years. I'm asking you guys, Moving On TV is all about solutions. Put me in touch with people that can help this young woman. Put me in touch with someone that can save her life because the media don't seem to be interested. I can't get anyone to support me, not until she's dead. No one will interview her because she's too vulnerable. But I can be interviewed as the person that is watching this tragedy. Please help me save her life. Help get me on the media to talk about this. To stop the madness, to stop the stigma of someone who's got serious BPD, who's going to court in July to be tried as a criminal. She's not a criminal, she's sick. And she doesn't need huge amounts of drugs for her to take more and more overdoses. She needs a little bit of medication, but a lot of therapy. And so I'm asking you, save her life with me. Don't let her die, please. I don't want to be here in six months time making a program saying that we all let her down, every single one of us. I'm doing everything I can here with Moving On TV. We're a CIC, a community interest company now. It's my job to try and do my best, but I can't do it on my own. You need to help me. Tell me what to do. Tell me what to do. The only person that has put anything on about this case, because this young woman was arrested naked. Can you believe it? In 2017, that women can be arrested naked? Yes, they can. They can. You didn't know that. Well, the only person who seems to care is Casey Armstrong on WMAP radio. What about England? What about our media? What about the Buck Street Press? What about our part of the world? Hi, Wickham. That's where she's from. I'm asking you to help me make a change for this person and millions like her. But let's start with one. Let's save one life. That's it. One life. I love you lot. Moving on TV, putting the hope back into your lives, into our lives even. I'm there for you. Please share this little promo everywhere. I beg of you. Let's save this young woman's life. Get in touch with me at lauren and moving on tv uk 07437 532 798. Save a life. One day. One life 
at a time. Thank you.